I like to see this when I come out here. Lamika Gideon greets police patrolling Camden streets with a sad smile. Sad because her 19 year old son Jawan died here, shot in the head three years ago when violence stalked the city and Camden logged 50 murders. My son was murdered right there on Sheridan. And it's, if it takes for them to be out here doing what they doing so I can get justice, I love it. Walk around and you see cops on the beat. Part of a brand new county police department, 411 officers brought in 16 months ago to replace the old guard. Mountie from Avenue's a rough neighborhood. Officer Chris Jeffries beat. Every day you'll encounter someone who is extremely happy to see you know, the police presence out there. Cops in the field get intel from a high-tech surveillance system and a very determined chief manages the whole operation. The result, a decrease in major crime rates so dramatic it surprises even the boss. This has exceeded even my most optimistic of, of expectations, but it's something to be said for uh, what can be done. By the numbers, since 2012, Camden's murder rate plunged 51 percent from 45 to 22 through this July. Rape decreased 46 percent from 57 to 31. Robbery dropped 26 percent from 495 to 367. Chief Thompson assigns officers to neighborhoods, urges them to interact. I tell them constantly, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not measuring your success by the number of tickets you write or arrests you make. I want to see your area of responsibility when I drive through there. I want to see people sitting on their front steps. I want to see children riding their bicycles playing baseball in the street. He's disturbed by images from Missouri, where Ferguson cops clashed violently with residents protesting the police shooting of a young black man. How you monitor a, a peaceful protest with uh, through the lens of a sniper rifle. The outside world's noticing to Camden's financial benefit. We have companies like the Hol like Holtec, the Philadelphia 76ers, and there's many others coming who now feel as though the city is safe enough to make a substantial investment. We like to have a clean place where people can come in and do business without being threatened. Many local shop owners applaud the efforts, say they'd like to see even more cops. Of course, not everyone's a fan. A lot of harassment from the officers. You can't even come out the store and smoke a cigarette while your sandwich is there. Lamika Gideon disagrees. There's good cops out here too, doing what they're supposed to do. I love it. I just love it. And I'm just waiting for justice for my son. Perhaps the ghost of Jawan Gideon walks these mean streets, but now police are walking them too, hoping to stem the violence and perhaps let the ghosts rest in peace. In Camden, I'm Brenda Flanagan, NJTV News.